Hi! Today I am bringing you an unboxing. This is a Vox Box from Influencer. I just got this in the mail yesterday. I got an email about a week ago that said I had been chosen for the Shimmer Vox Box. There was some kind of reveal that happened online, but I was at work that day, so I have no idea what's in here. Um, the Influencer Vox Boxes are something that you get chosen for when you have an account on Influencer. On Influencer, you write reviews and you like share your input on products. You have questions and answers about different products. There's all sorts of stuff that goes on there. Um, and when you do a lot of reviews, you attach your social media accounts. You agree to like share stuff on your social media about it. You can sometimes get chosen for these Vox Boxes. Um, so this one has this cute little pattern. It's got some like health and beauty products, some like little food. It looks like maybe even like pet stuff. So who knows what could be in here? This is a little bit larger than some of the other ones I've gotten too. So I, who knows what could be in here? All right. And there's always some paperwork in here, like the little shimmer box box. There's a list of the products on the back, but I'm not gonna look at that yet. I've got, it looks like some of the products I've used before, so I'm excited about that. I've got a picture here, Global Beauty Secrets, Cultural Traditions, Indigenous Ingredients. Uh, hello, Influencer. You've been chosen by a new natural skincare brand. Okay, and I've gotten stuff from, I believe it was pronounced Nekeo. I've gotten stuff from them in one of the other Vox boxes I've done, too. And then Eva NYC, which I've gotten... Vox boxes with their stuff in it too, and I've got a coupon here for two dollars off. Uh, I know Target carries them, so that's nice. Um, all right, let's get into the products. It looks like that's all the uh, paperwork. So I got a little mini tester of Vera Wang Embrace, which is green tea and pear blossom. I already have some perfume on, but let's try it anyway. That's nice. It is very uh, fresh. You can tell the the pear blossom, the green tea. It makes sense. It would. It's definitely a like green. It smells like the color of the package. <laughs> um, I don't know if anybody else ever thinks that way. I usually, not usually, but often think of scents in terms of colors. I also got a, a mini of the Eva NYC Freshen Up Dry Shampoo. I've gotten a mini just like this in another Influencer Vox box, and I love this stuff. I used the other stuff up really quickly, and I thought about purchasing a big one, but I'm kind of glad I didn't now, because now I have another mini I can go through, and I can use that coupon to, to buy myself another one. I really like the Eva NYC products I've tried. I've tried this one, and then the little 10-in-1 uh, Primer Potion. I love that stuff. It smells amazing. But the dry shampoo is really good because it smells really good, but it doesn't leave like any kind of white cast in your hair, which is really important for like, especially once I've transitioned to my fall purple, the white cast can look bizarre on that. Uh, looks like next I've got, here's my Nekeo, uh, Red Ginseng Line Smoothing Eye and Lip Cream. Their cute little sample packets are always nice. It's usually like, Oh, the last one I got was the coffee scrub, and it was enough to do it twice. And so with like a moisturizing cream like this, it'll probably, looks like it'll probably be enough for two or three times if it's a lip and eye cream especially. And then I've got a little, ooh, Impress Press On Manicures. I actually have used one of these before. It was like a little silver tipped one, and it's actually what I wore when Jack proposed to me. So good timing on that, but... This one has little white and silver glitter ones, and ones that say love. Very cute. I was, all, I'm really impressed with the Impress last time. It lasted over two weeks, so I will definitely let you know how much this one lasts. It's really cute, so uh, thank goodness for that. I don't usually wear white nails, so it might bother me a little bit, but I will, I will do it. I will take one for the team. <laughs> And then it said something in one of the emails about there would be a little snack, so this is what it was. I've got Sour Punch Straws with no high fructose corn syrup. Real Rainbow Soft Chewy Candy Straws. We've got Strawberry Lemon Green Apple Tangerine. So it looks like it's pretty much the Sour Punch Straws, but a little bit more like natural ingredients, a little bit better for you, probably. If there's no high fructose corn syrup, that makes me happy. 
Let's see. Ha! <laughs> but the first ingredient is still corn syrup. Of course. Okay. There is no salt in them though, so that's good. But it's 27 grams of carbs and 11 grams of sugars, which is all added sugars. And that is per five pieces. So a fourth of this little container. So um, with it being the Sour Punch Straws, that'll probably go to Jack because he loves sour candy. But I'll probably share that with him before I share. And that is everything that was in my little Vox box this time. It was a really cute little one. Um, probably shimmer because of the nails. And the, the candy is like a sparkly sugar covered kind of thing. Kind of makes sense. Very cute though. And I always love these Vox boxes. I'm sure you'll see my update posts from the... Uh, what are they called? The brand badges. So like the kind of sharing that I do through Influencer, I'm sure you'll see updates from me on the products that I use. So thanks so much for watching and have an awesome day. Bye-bye.